Central Blanco County, Eastern Gillespie County, until 12.45 p.m. Central Daylight Time. At 12.04 p.m. Central Daylight Time, a severe thunderstorm was located near Granville or near Fredericksburg, moving southeast at 20 miles per hour. Hazard, 60 miles per hour in Central Blanco County. Source, radar indicated. Impact, hail damage to vehicles is expected. Expect wind damage to roofs, siding, and trees. Or near Fredericksburg. Locations and include Fredericksburg, Stonewall, High, Willow, Willow City, Rocky Hill, LBJ State Park, and LBJ National Historical Park. For your protection, move to an interior room on the lowest floor of a building. Large hail, damaging winds, and continuous cloud to ground lightning are occurring with this storm. Move indoors immediately. Lightning is one of nature's leading killers. Remember, if you can hear the thunder, you are close enough to be struck by lightning. Your local forecast. Rest of today, partly cloudy. A slight chance of showers and thunderstorms late this morning. Remember, you are close enough to be struck by thunderstorms may be severe. For your protection, you to an interior room on the lowest floor of a building. Large hail, damaging winds, and continuous cloud to ground lightning are occurring with this storm. Move indoors immediately. Lightning is one of nature's leading killers. Remember. If you can hear thunder, you are close enough to be struck by lightning. Ooh. Ironically, I have my uh, window sealed at this time of the hour. But I'm not sure if we're going to get some rain. Oh, look at it. Look at this thing. The National Weather Service in Austin, San Antonio has issued a severe thunderstorm warning for West Central Blanco County, Southeastern Gillespie County, Northern Kendall County, until 1.15 p.m. Central Daylight Time. Oh, shoot, Kendall County. At 12.20 p.m. Central Daylight Time, a severe thunderstorm was located near Fredericksburg, moving southeast at 20 miles per hour. Hazard, 60 miles per hour wind gust and quarter size hail. Source, the two big cities. Indicated. Impact, hail damage to vehicles is expected. Expect wind damage to roofs. All three of those stations gone now. Locations impacted include Fredericksburg, Sisterdale, Bluegrass, Blumenthal, Lookamock, King City, Old Tunnel State Park, Grapetown, Rocky Hill, and Bakersmith. For your protection, move to an interior room on the lowest floor of a building. Large hail, damaging winds, and continuous clouds around lightning are occurring with this storm. Moving in towards the video lane. Lightning is one of nature's leading killers. Remember, if you can hear thunder, you are close enough to be struck by lightning. This is so bad. Lightning is one of nature's leading killers. Remember, if you can hear thunder, you are close enough to be struck by lightning. The 2.69, the relative humidity was 53 percent, producing a heat index of 92. The wind sounds at seven miles an hour, and the pressure was 29.87 inches and falling. At Camp Maybury, it was mostly sunny. The temperature was 86. The oh, wait, check this out. The relative oh, humidity song. was 54. Check this out. Look how small that is. It's a good thing I found that. It works pretty well. Service 
There you go. Your phone is still in March. Your phone is still in March. Number 260. It's effective until 7 p.m. Central Daylight Time. Your phone is still Two six zero. Okay. Late start because I had a. Uh, was washing the dishes. I'm gonna make sure that's not KX fifty six. I didn't get to hear. Yep, it is. Nintendo's right near the outside wall. You gotta get better than that. You're the only station I was able to get earlier. We get a Tazar. Does those, oh yeah, and K Wed. Taliban? What? Oh, wow. Okay, I got KZAR, so, and KXI 56 um, EON. I moved to see uh, the Eton Zone Guard, so it actually makes sense now, now that I look at KWED. I thought this uh, radio alone was having issues. It's actually the transmitter, hence the beeping that I heard earlier. I'm sure I told PJ this, and he's aware now. Um, KWED, that, that pulls from WNG 641, I actually was doing the same thing as I was experiencing the problem. That was my bad. I didn't realize it at first, but um, the beeping, I've never heard that through an AM FM relay. But it's also common when you pull alerts from an NWR transmitter. So, yeah. Just thought that was interesting. Um, I missed the other SVR. Because I didn't have... I'm not putting this on WSK67. This is. Which is why you saw Channel 7. I don't know why this one's not getting it well. But... Nothing's happening in WG, WWG55's area, so... Yeah. That's a big one.